now let us discuss about for in loop in javascript for in is useful in order to iterate or in order to repeat over an array over an object so if we want to iterate or repeat over an object then we have to use as for in loop uh, we know that in javascript array is nothing but an object so let us see an example where a is equal to we know that in javascript array contains different types of elements uh, let the first element is number integer number second one is some floating point number next one is some string string uh, let the next one is uh, a boolean value boolean value uh, now let us display the contents of object a array is treated as an object here a is an object so let us see the syntax for the for, for it let us declare uh, i a variable called i for within the parenthesis variable here what is the variable i in we have to use a keyword called in and after that we have to specify object over which object we have to iterate let we want to iterate over a uh, now let us display the content here document dot document dot write of i document dot write of i let us observe what is the output now let us observe what is the output now so if you observe the output here here what is the output what is the output here if you observe the output uh, here the output is 0 uh, 0123 is the output that means here we are getting index values but initially of index values if we want to display the contents of the object then we have to use that object name also a of i a of i then what will happen is all the contents of the object will be printed let us see what is the output now let us see what is the output if we observe the output here so first uh, integer number 10 next to floating point number 2.345 next to that string sudhakar next to boolean value false got printed uh, now let us see about uh, uh, with the help of an you know, object uh, let us let us uh, declare an you know, object now where let name of the object is b b is equal to object means it contains key value pair let the first key is name colon uh, let the name is sudhakar colon uh, so here what is uh, key value key means name various value means sudhakar let us have another key uh, let the key is gender gender uh, male in javascript we can uh, enclose the string within the double quotation or single quotation also uh, next one is uh, 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 let the rule number let the rule number is 72 so rule number means key whereas value means 72 now our target is we want to display the content of that object uh, so for that purpose let us use i already i is declared so for i in i in b b next document dot write off document dot write off let us use header tag so that the content will be displayed in uh, larger font size and in bold style uh, let us display i i so plus i use concatenation operator next uh, is that means uh, name is name is sudhakar we have to display sudhakar in order to display the content we have to use the object so plus b of what is the variable name i plus close the head attack close the head attack now let us analyze what is the output what is the output let us see what is the output if you observe the output name is sudhakar gender is m rule number is 72 got printed so here i means i means key key will be printed what is the key here name gender and roll number whereas value means we have to use that object as well as index okay 
now let us see how we can calculate uh, uh, some of the uh, an array elements or some of an object with the help of uh, uh, for in loop so if you want to perform the if you want to calculate sum over an elements then we have to use numbers only it may be integer numbers or floating point numbers any numbers why because in javascript we have only number data type okay we can't declare we can't initialize strings boolean values and null okay so for i in what is the name of the array c for i in c uh, here we we have to calculate sum so let us declare uh, a variable s yes, the initial value of the s is 0 now let us calculate s yes. s yes is equal to s yes plus c of i s yes is equal to s yes plus c of i now let us display uh, s value so document dot document dot write off i uh, use header tag sum is sum is plus the result is available in sum close the header tag close the header tag okay close the header tag now let us see what is the output so 10 plus 20 plus 30 means 60 uh, 100 100 150 so we need to get 150 as the output let us observe what is the output if you see the output sum is 150 so likewise uh, uh, we can use foreign loop in javascript so foreign is mainly useful in order to iterate over an object array is also treated as an object in javascript